may have overheard some of our ladies sharing about our recent holy makeover event. Of course, a picture is worth a thousand words, right? So take a peek as we reflect on our weekend of praise, study, fellowship, and as always, food. With contagious smiles and warm hugs, Janet and Paula were full of energy as they facilitated our very powerful two-day event. Oh, and they had some very talented helpers. What a treat to get to visit with former members Barbara White and Linda Griffin. They are serving God in Oklahoma and Colorado now. It's good to know we have such capable people on the mission field. Heather led our praise and worship beautifully, while Michelle kept us busy posing for her trusty photographer's eye. How blessed is this mom, spending such a special weekend with her daughters, a real family affair. As you can see, smiles were the predominant accessory throughout the day, and that Kathy Jackson, wow. She sure knows how to feed a bunch of hungry gals. Delicious and more than we could ever eat. Vegetarian, gluten-free, sugar-free, you name it, Kathy had it covered. She even had Tums and aspirin. Time for fun and more fun. We examined our spiritual shape and ways to enhance it. Lynn taught us about hugs and so much more. Twyla led us in a study of the fruit of the spirit. Now prior to the event, there were work days and lots of planning days. Marge and Pam were full of ideas and unlimited energy. Sister love, priceless. Lori and her ping pong balls of forgiveness, they just keep popping up. Our own journalist, Tina Siders, signed copies of her publication for everyone. What a great gift. Oh, and did I mention fun? A lovely girl is like a melody, even if the tune was a bit off. Dressed for any occasion, Pat, Jana, and I don't know who, kept us smiling as they modeled their unique fashion ensembles. Well, especially Twyla, with her take on a certain well-known lingerie establishment. Prayer without ceasing. Time to share and encourage in small groups. Our hearts swelled in praise and worship through beautiful music. As Saturday's sessions drew to a close, we prayerfully shared in Holy Communion. There was a special time to bless and be blessed. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord look upon you with kindness and give you peace. Amen and amen. Now who said they were on the cleanup committee? <laughs>